Hello, this is World of Tanks Tuesday with Crazyman7777. Um, so obviously this is not, this is not what I said it would be. I said I was going to do an FPS game and I haven't been able to. Uh, for a couple reasons that I'll talk about later. But, first, news about Halo Mega Blocks and stuff. Um, very soon now I will be able to get, um new Halo Mega Bloks sets with um with some interesting differences from the old sets which we'll talk about when we get there. I'm sure that you're already aware of it, but obviously Halo Mega Bloks is going to start um making upgraded versions of the original figures where you can take off the armor and the shoulders move and all that good stuff. So that the Halo Mega Block sets, um, the Halo Mega Block figures can actually move their own, um, can hold their own guns like they do in an actual game. So that's going to be pretty exciting. And um, right now I'm looking at um, first doing the um, UNSC um, Wombat plus ODSC Rookie set, which I'm not quite sure what the name of it is. Um, because that one seems to be the cheapest. It costs about 20 bucks, and the actual price is supposed to be 10 bucks. So that's pretty good for a set that's supposed to come out in uh, um, later or fall. And from there, I'll hopefully be getting a set like every like month or so, or every two every month, something like that. Um, and you can for sure count on that I will be getting every single one of these new sets since I now have the uh, money or resources as we shall say and I now also have um, the time to do said things and if you guys haven't noticed I have been on uh, vacations a lot this summer to interesting places which I'm not going to talk about right now because that's not what my videos are about ouch but um now that all that is over and I will mostly be here I will be here enough that videos will be regular and on schedule for the majority of the time in the next couple weeks or so which is awesome and hopefully like I said I will be able to get these new sets uh, for Halo Mega Blocks I estimate that I'll probably have one by next week or the week after that and I will make a video because as you know um, no as you don't know I use Amazon to get my actual um, Hail Mega Block sets so uh, Amazon does not usually have things uh, for pre-ordering when it comes to Hail Mega Blocks but this time they do um, they're really expensive right now like I said the thing that should be ten dollars is twenty dollars so I'm gonna wait a little bit um, I'm gonna wait a little bit to actually get these sets, and hopefully by next week they will be cheap enough that I will want to actually not waste my money on it. So there you go. That's my Halo Mega Blocks news. Um, in World Tanks Xbox 360 news. Um, Quite a few things have been added, which I haven't gone over yet. Firstly, the um, Waffle Tranger, or um, what we like to say in Mortal Tanks, a Waffle Tractor um, update has been added, where the uh, wa the Waffle Tranger E100 has been added. I know I, I know I'm pronouncing it wrong, but I'm just gonna say it like that because it's kind of fun to say Waffle. Anyway. So the Waffle Trigger E100 um, line has been added, the, which starts with the PZ-38T, uh, and the um, T-57 Heavy line has been added, which is awesome, and that is basically like an automatic version of the, it's an uh, auto fire, or sorry, auto loader version of the um, heavy tanks in the, um, heavy in the American lines so we'll talk about that when I get there 
I already have the first of them, it's the M7, so um, I'm going to do a review of the M7 because hopefully by the middle of this week or so, I will actually have the M7's full upgrade. Right now it's pretty good though, that's what I'll say about it for now. So I'm going to end on, on the Freedom Tank right here, that's on 6% health. See you guys next